he beat Shine, of course. So that's going to be at least one player he has some familiar with. How will Ken do in the Ken Wolf matchup? That's, of course, a matchup we saw in the first set of the day. Yeah, and we saw how well Ken was able to really uh, control Wolf and really get those combos off. So K9 actually often to switch to the Joker. Interesting. I've seen him, you know, deviate a bit away from Wolf to go for Wario, but this is the first time I'm familiar with him going Joker. Oh, we're going to have to have him switch sides. Javi not needed. Oh, sir. So yeah, Nito definitely making a name for himself. I saw him with that Ken play, really impressive. People, okay, at the beginning, people talked about Ken, right? And then everyone started to doubt Ken, because we're like, everyone's just like, where, where are the placements? Where are these Ken players coming from? But hopefully we have to see something out, because we saw how well Ken's able to do in that first match. Let's see how we can do it in the second one. Yeah, absolutely. We've seen some top tier Ken play coming in from guys like Sandstorm, guys like Riddles, people who've showcased what this character can do on the top tier of stages and even waits out that entire Rebels Guard. Such, such good timing for me to just shows that matchup experience. Yeah, because usually you usually just go for the grab, right? But Ken doesn't have the best grab combos, so opts to wait for the Rebels Guard to get out of it, and here come the combos that up there. Forcing out a lot of options and no tech on that part, but that surely will follow up. One, uh, one strong, sure you, one strong jab, strong jab should be able to shut up the stock. So K9's definitely got to be careful. Yeah, an excellent work from K9. Just has to go in. Although he does have such a powerful edge guarding tool with that Tetrakarn. Of course, that sure you can, if it does want to use, be used as a recovering tool, that will catch it out 100% of the time. And Arsene's off the board. I love this patience from Nito. It's kind of that level 10 CPU mentality. We saw Zach Ray do it a lot. You just wait and wait for your opponent to make these bad punishes. And as soon as I say that, easy confirm from Nito. Yeah. Can't get that joke. Nito is, I think, perhaps one of the safest players in California. And perhaps that's just a byproduct of the character he plays. But I rarely ever see him go for these riskier options, especially when he's, you know, not down. And, it's, and Nito definitely did a good job of getting off that platform immediately because Joker, we've seen many times from MK Leo, that's not going to kill for sure, but MK Leo, it makes you, it makes you like cry anytime you're on those platforms because he's got that dragon up there, but thankfully k is able to get a stock, but Nito, biding his time, he knows exactly when to strike, he went for the level 2 Shoryuken into that confirm, but unable to find it. Yeah, one thing we're going to see within this matchup is a lot of Tatsumaki and Pukens, especially when Arsene is active, those multi-hits very effective at depleting the meter as much as possible. And also, what's going to be really good for Nito, he's going to get that confirmed, sends Joker right to the skies. And Nito, already with a very impressive lead, I guess Soul Cow is going to feel the rage of the Kens coming in through the Ken Masters. Yeah, perhaps. K9's far from out of this, by the way, and if he does have some of these back throws and back airs, you know, they might close out a Ken stock particularly early if Arsene is available and the Tetracurn comes into effect. And I love the use of Nito's Tatsumaki. He's not re he's recovering high anytime K9 comes in with counter, because right now he's gonna go for the counter anytime he wants for the show you can off stage, but right now he's making K9 think twice before doing it, and it's forcing it's forcing uh, this Joker into some really uncomfortable positions, and Nito opting to stay really safe. He knows that he's a, c a kill confirm away from taking it, but the up smash K9 calls out his bluff. But just as you say that, Arsene seconds away from expiring, and there we see it. K9s will have to do this solo. Sojo, as yep. the cool kids say. Sojo, Sopo. I don't know, there's a lot of things you can say, but Nito, he knows that he's so close to killing him, and Perhaps closer than you think, Nito. Just very potent. And, you know, Ken is a character that is chock full of kill power. He did it. He did indeed, that thumbs up. Oh, God. Just it's just... I respect Ken, right? But it's so painful seeing... It's really fun, I should, I should say. It's really cool seeing these Ken players pull off these really impressive things. But it hurts. It hurts seeing you die at 71% from a heavy jab into a true Shoryuken. So hopefully Kanan's got a different plan because if he goes Wolf, hopefully he won't end up like that first match we saw. Yeah, perhaps indeed. Nito just posted a tweet on uh, about an hour ago just saying, you know, Wolf's, uh, it was, 
you know, there's there's this meme, and I'm describing. You'll have to look it up yourself. We do see the wolf come out. You know, he just described his favorite type of sandwich, and it was a PB and J with multiple instances yeah, yeah, yeah. of the text with 40% yeah, written all yeah. over it. Oh of course, God. Nito can and often does close out these kills much early and much earlier than other can be. Okay, well, hopefully, K9's got an answer to this. Yeah, hopefully, this won't end up in a Groundhog Day situation. We will be hoping to see a different result for K9s. Because K9, it's unfortunate K9 has to be Nito so early in this bracket. It is. Uh, you never just want to run into a specialist this early in pools. And especially when he gets you in the 40%, he's chasing him down. nito has got a read on Kanon already, but as soon as they speak that, he's able to get these combo screens out, reads the air dodge, but right now, Wolf has to get those edge ledge traps off. And one thing that Kanon has to be particularly careful of, Wolf shield is slightly smaller than Joker's, so he does have to be aware of shield breaks that will and will come in very, very high and very, very often. And I love how Nito is searching for these missed text opportunity. Kanan should not be missing these at all, especially for a player of his caliber, but that down smash surely finds its mark. Yeah, just read the tech, or the missed tech, rather. And now it's K9 in the lead for the first time this entire set. But we both know that he is one hit away from dying. Yeah, excellent, you know, apologies to Koenig, but excellent call out there with the Shoryuken. Just read him right into oblivion he knew where he was going to land and without you know and with that air dodge burned nothing he could do that, was, that could have been a shield break set up but is like that look at these tatsumaki trains he's a hurricane of percentages right now and the weak part of the f tilt gonna be forcing out a little more options 36 percent of these pressing kicks these kicks coming out of nowhere he went for the hard read, but remember, just like in Street Fighter 4, you can uh, you can do your dash cancel on that, and great turnaround, but no kill just yet. Yeah, that's an excellent way of playing Ken. Of course, Ken and Ryu both turn around automatically in this game to face their opponents. That's just a byproduct of Ultimate's new mechanics for them. He's able to turn around. You can't cross them up so well. Another Shoryuken. How many, you know, can we get a counter in chat how many stocks you've taken with Shoryuken so far? Because it has to be, you know, at least three or four. I mean... There's definitely a lot of shurikens being thrown out, but it's not just mindlessly being thrown out. He's chasing down K9. He's getting these confirms down with such confidence in K9. He's got to have an answer and soon. Another missed tech tech. into the dash attack. K9s will punish these every way. He knows how. Wolf has three or four different tools to punish. Of course, the down smash, the down tilt if you want to go for another trip. If you want to go for the fair and the dare confirm as well, that's a bit riskier, but... And I love this stuff. Is that a kill? That is a kill. K9's just falling too early, getting too stocked by Nito. Nito, Nitro, it don't matter no more. My goodness, able to get those things down. Those confirms are on point. I didn't expect that to kill. I thought it was going to be a level two Shuriken because that's definitely the more reliable.